Ladies and gents, this is the moment you've been waiting for. Let's get this royal purple out of her. Get her cleaned up a little bit before we go for the weekend. And get some of that Shell Rotella 5W30 gas truck formula in her. Let's go! So you guys can see, 242, 112. I'm like miles short of 5,000 miles. And this change engine oil has been on for two days. And I've been trying to push it close to exactly 5,000 miles. And now here we are. Let's send it. Pretty clean. 242,000 miles. Pretty dang clean. I like it. it. Smells like no fuel at all. This is probably the least amount... I, all the other ones I smell a little bit, a little bit of fuel, but not bad. You know, normal, this one here, I don't smell no fuel with this Royal Purple. No fuel smelling the oil at all. There we go. Oh, so nice and quiet, like a single sewing machine. Oh, at 5,000 miles, she is crystal clean, but we're changing it anyway. Let's get to it. All right, let's get up under here and get this, get this old girl. Ow, that's hot. Take my lock off. Flip my little lever. Go ahead and let it drain for a little bit. Go ahead and pull the Fram Ultra off. Maybe pull that off and then I'll get the other one at least put on. All right, so filters on. Everything cleaned off down here. Let's get it back on the ground and get it filled up with six quarts of 5W30 Shell Rotella, baby. Gas truck formula, 5W30 full synthetic. Got our sample here. Got to get our paperwork filled out. Drop our Blackstone Labs in the bag now. Cannot do it if it's not in the bag. It has to be in the bag now. Or you can, but it's going to take longer because the post office don't like seeing it without the bag on it. Anyhow, let's continue. So here, 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 so y'all can look, 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 All right, took five from the first one, and there's four right there. Took one from this one, so we got six quarts in our, let's flood mode it, record everything, fill out our paperwork, and get it sent off, and I'll give you my thoughts. Okay, we're full, we're full, we are full. All right, flood mode, key on, gas pedal to the ground, cranker, five seconds. One, two, three, four, five, let go of the gas. Flood mode complete. Now we gotta reset the oil. Well, I'm going to give you my thoughts on this. I feel like the Royal Purple actually kept the motor quieter longer. I noticed it's just a little bit quieter with the Royal Purple, closer to that four to 5,000 mark, but didn't really notice anything too crazy about it, but I also didn't notice anything bad either. Um, I think it was a little quieter, and I think right at that four or 5,000 mark where it starts to shear, you know, the Mobile One, the... Uh, Pennzoil Platinum Ultra, the any of the oils that I've done so far, you start to see it, other than AMS oil. AMS oil, uh, I didn't really start to hear hear a lot of clatter until for, kind of the same with this Royal Purple. It's about four or five thousand miles. You hear just a little bit clatter on startup. Mobile probably the soonest out of all of them. 
But anyway, I uh, the oil was it ran phenomenal in the car. There was nothing wrong with it. A lot of people were talking trash. Oh, your your engine's gonna make noise. Your engine's gonna do this. Gonna do that. You no, know, it's just good. It's good oil. Oil is oil. Change it off, and that's all you have to do. But what we're doing here is we're doing like about five thousand mile intervals, and we're just kind of feeling it out, seeing what's there, seeing what numbers come back, seeing how you know as. Uh, I'm running these engine oils through the same engine over and over again with the same filter over and over again. Um, I'm going to go back and run Mobile One Extended Performance over again as well. This is the one that I, uh, I mean, this is the vehicle that we're doing all the testing on. So I find um, it's pretty consistent overall. As long as you're changing your oil between, let's even say four to 5,000 miles. I really like to change my oil by three. When all this is done, I'll, I will continue changing my oil by 3,000 miles. Um, as long as you're changing your oil and filter, you're maintaining your vehicle, it really doesn't matter what oil you're putting in your vehicle as long as it's decent quality. Even regular conventional oil, like you know, Penn's oil, Mobile, uh, any type Castrol, whatever it may be, as long as it's a good oil and you're changing it by 3,000 miles, even conventional would be good. Full synthetic up to you know four or 5,000 miles. 100% synthetic like AMS oil and Redline and um, who's that? Uh, what's that other? Uh, there's a couple other high-end oils out there that I would run. I could see somebody trying to push six, seven thousand miles, but no more than that. I don't like these extended OCIs and stuff. Well, this started up with this oil is really quiet, very, very quiet. So anyway, uh, that's my thoughts on the Royal Purple. It did very well. It did very, 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 very well. So we're going to send it off, get it tested, see what numbers come back. In the meantime, we're going to be running Shell Rotella. Again, 242,112 miles. So I will see you back here again for the next oil at roughly 247,112. 250 or uh, 247,000 miles is when I'll see you back here again for the next oil change on the Panther Platform car. They'll be blessed. Take care and have a great day night.